Hello and welcome to OnPoint Software Video Tutorials for Spectrum Business Intelligence Module. In today's video, we'll take a look at creating an interactive report. So let's get started by clicking on Business Intelligence menu and create interactive report. And we get prompted to select the data source, which are predefined by Spectrum. In today's example, let's uh, choose the job cost transaction data source, where we'll create an interactive report with costs for jobs, where we can also try to group those costs by phase and by cost type. So here we see the menu layout screen where on the left side we have our fields that we can add to our report. And then on the right side we have the layout of the report itself, which we can then modify accordingly. So let's go ahead and add our uh, report fields. I'm going to drag the company code. Let's add the job code and a description. Let's add our phase code and description. And the cost type and description. And finally, let's add the cost. So here now we have all the fields that we want to see on our report laid out in the order we want to see them. So now let's go ahead and modify the report just to show the data that we want to see. So we first want to exclude all companies except uh, the, our company, which in this case would be ABC. So we can click on the little down arrow here and we can select filter. And we can select from a list and I'm just going to choose ABC. This will refresh and now I only have ABC companies. I'd like to group these by job. So I'm going to take the job code and just drag it to the top. So now I'm grouping my report by job. I'd also like to group it by the face code. So I'm going to drag the face code column just beneath the job code. And now I'm sorting grouping by job code and phase code. So within the phase code, I'd also like to group by cost type. So let's take the cost type column and pop that beneath the phase code. So now I have all my different cost types for each phase code for each job, all grouped. And if you notice on the left-hand menu, we see all the different group sortings that we have just done. I can also add a subtotal to each uh, cost type for the cost. So I'll just go to the cost column, use my pull down, and I'll say summary and sum. So now we see that each cost Cost type has a cost and a summary. We can now save this report and we can export it as well. So let's go ahead and save this report. I'm going to save it in my folder and I'm going to call it JC Transaction by Cost Type. I also want to export my report uh, to PDF, but before I do that, I can also go ahead and change the title of the report. So I'll say JC Transaction. Oops. By cost type. And then I have my report title. So let's go ahead and export this. I'm going to export it to PDF. I can also do it to Excel. Uh, I'll choose PDF today. 
And here I see my transaction report by cost type, showing all my costs with some totals for each cost type as well. I hope you enjoyed this video on creating an interactive report in Spectrum Business Intelligence. Thank you very much and uh, hope to see you for the next video.